Hi guys. Hope you all are doing good. Let's start the weekend analysis right away on your JPY. But first, let's recap the previous movements. The price was here when the previous analysis was posted. The price printed double top and MLV is expected in the analysis. The sell took place all over on daily. About 400 pips movement. After the formation of MLV on H4, CSAK cell formed. Then, simple, re entry. Momentum. Re-entry Momentum Re-entry And so on. There were also many re-entries on the H1 time frame. Now, CSM buy is there in the H4. Let's start the analysis now. Remember guys, always start your analysis from the higher time frames. Like weekly or monthly, for me, monthly is best to start with. Monthly has a CSM buy. We have talked about it in the previous analysis. Weekly also has a CSM buy. And now there is a re-entry of weekly CSM. Jumping on the daily time frame. There is a rejection from the lower bands, which is extreme B. Before that, there is MLV point. And the MLV has extreme behind it. When the MA5 goes out of the bands, it is known as extrema. After MLV setup, CSAK sell occur. CSAK occurs because the price wants to do a higher time frame. Re entry. In this case, it is weekly. The daily CSAK sell is a roadblock for the price to go higher. We also have to look out for that. But our main focus is weekly, because it is bigger than daily time frame. The main focuses are the daily CSAK sell and weekly re-entry by now. Let's filter out weekly re-entry. Re-entry, time frame 1. In time frame 2, daily, there is rejection of price from low BB, which is extreme B. So the code is RE. There, the price was unable to make a sell momentum. On time frame 3, H4, there is MLV point. And also rejection from low BB. 
during the formation of MLV Point. Ballinger banned star curving. So, also had stoppage. And finally, there occurred CSA K buy in time frame 3, which confirmed the co or EM. After the re-entry of CSA K buy, CSM buy has formed continuing the bullish move. So, the weekly move has started. The only barrier for the price to move up is CSA K sell on daily. But we should be hopeful towards the weekly to continue its bullishness. The current situation on Euro JPY is a little tricky. Filtering out daily now. By looking at time frame 2, there is no extrema 4. No code is there yet for the daily ray entry. Time frame 3 is forming extreme and MLV. But it is not useful because time frame 2, H4, is not supporting the cells for daily. After analyzing all the time frames well, buying is looking strong on Euro JPY. We should focus on the buys right now. After CSM buy, hoping a ray entry either 2MA510 low or mid DB. Just like the street lights lit this town Like a fire in a blaze, gotta burn it down Can't be afraid to leave this out There is also a breakout of EMA50 on the H4 making the buys more stronger. H4 is the key time frame now. If the CSA K sell gets respected, then the market can look for double bottom and so on. Same like previous situation. In conclusion, if you want to be safe, wait for daily to do a CSAK buy. Then, you can look for safe buys. But if you want to be aggressive, then monitor H for for potential entries. I also recommend waiting for the CSAK buy on daily for safe trades. Let's hope it plays out as expected. Good luck guys.